Assalamu alaikum students this is Hamza Noor and today I am here with a few questions of the topic permutation and combination and 14th of October is the big day for A levels maths S1 paper so here are some questions from the most recent attempts May June 2020 first one is paper 5 one question number two find the number of different arrangements that can be made from the nine letters of the word jewelry in which the three E's are together and the two L's are together. All together you have nine letters. You will make nine spaces first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. All right. Three E's are together and two L's are together. Three E's are together because first you have to deal with the restrictions. Three E's are here together and two L's are together and the elements which are together you consider them as a single block okay so how many spaces do you have to fill one two three four and then you have one block over here and then you have another block over here one two three four five six all right so this goes like six factorial but wait a minute these two L's can arrange themselves in two factorial ways. All right. And these three E's can arrange themselves in three factorial ways. But wait, three E's are repeating themselves and two L's are repeating themselves. So two factorial, two factorial cancelled out, three factorial and three factorial cancelled out. Your final answer is supposed to be six factorial only which is equal to 720. Let's come on to the next part. Next part is saying that find the number of different arrangements that can be made from the nine letters of the word Julie in which two L's are not next to each other. Here you have two approaches to solve this and I'm going to explain both of them. All right. Two L's are not next to each other. What if two L's are next to each other? And I subtract those number of possible arrangements from the total arrangements. All right. So let's assume that two L's are together. Uh, how many letters do you have? Nine total letters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay. So let's assume that two L's are together. They are next to each other. Okay. So you consider them as one single block. So how many spaces you have to fill now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this is a, a single block, eight factorial. All right. But wait a minute. These two L's can arrange themselves in two factorial ways. And two L's are repeating themselves divided by two factorial. But wait. Uh, <clears throat> how many other letters are repeating? E is occurring three times, isn't it? E is occurring three times. So three factorial in the denominator. Two factorial and two factorial cancel out and your final and I mean the number of arrangements in which two L's can be next to each other are eight factorial upon three factorial. This is six seven two zero. But what are the total possible arrangements? The total possible arrangements are uh, without restrictions. If there were no restrictions, if there were no restriction, this part A answer is giving you the ways, the arrangements with restrictions. And the restrictions are that three, are, three E's are together and two L's are together. First, you need to find number of arrangements without restrictions. All together, how many letters do you have? Nine, so nine factorial in which three E's are repeating, so three factorial in the denominator and two L's are repeating, so two factorial in the denominator. These are the total arrangements without any restrictions, all right? Nine factorial divided by three factorial into two factorial. This is three zero two four zero. So the final answer is supposed to be total possible arrangements minus uh, when Minus the number of arrangements when L were together because we don't want L's next to each other. All right. So the final answer is 30240 minus 6720. 
and this is two three five two zero two three five two zero is your answer this is one way of doing this question and now let's talk about the other one we don't want two l's next to each other right so let's use a separating model let's just separate these two e's out from your total possible spaces there were total possible spaces were nine so if you are separating two l's out how many spaces are you left with seven obviously so let's make seven spaces one two three four five six and seven all right and we don't want l's next to each other we want them to be separated so what are the possible positions where i can put the letter l l can be kept over here it can be kept over here it can be kept over here 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 as well here as well here as well here as well these are the possible positions where l letters can be kept how many possible positions do we are are we having now for l i mean how many possible positions are there for l how many arrows are there one two three four five six seven eight eight how many l's do i have two eight p two multiply by the number of spaces which are left one two three four five six seven multiply by seven factorial but wait a minute three e's will repeat so divide by three factorial and two l's will also repeat divide by two factorial simple asani se baat samajh aa rahi dekho dono method se dono se kiye ja sakte hain jo dimag mein zyada asani se baith jaye wo apply kar dena 8p2 multiply by 7 factorial divided by 3 factorial multiply by 2 factorial this is 23520 straight away four marks for this working as well theek okay. hai